And see, the thing is, to all you females that still get Section 8 food stamps or on Section 8, you're still going to lose, okay? Your time is up because of Agenda 21, okay? Did you not know that they're going to go up on the rent on Section 8 threefold? I'll give you an example of what that means. Let's say that there's an apartment that you see that originally goes for $1,500 a month. When the rent increase on that, which it will, guess how much you would have to pay? $1,300 for that month. So, you're still going to lose. The game is over. And we as black men of America, we're supposed to be happy. Why? Because all of these things you chose to use to make yourself an asshole towards us. The welfare system didn't design for you to be an asshole towards us. You were supposed to use that food stamps temporary to help yourself and your children if you had some. Okay. The welfare system didn't uh, put that system together for you to become an asshole towards us. It was the same thing. Temporary uses to help you and your children. Section 8. They didn't design that for you to become an asshole towards us. They designed it for you to get yourself together and your children. To get off of all of these things. No, you, again, always trying to be slick and skanky. Decided to use it for other ways that it wasn't designed to. And now they're taking it away from you. So all of you ones that's leaving these old psychotic, crazy ass, unrealistic messages. Okay, or well, comments in my comment section. Okay. That don't mean shit. They're still going to take it away from you. If you don't believe me, Google Agenda 21. Download the book so you can read it for yourself. You're still going to lose. The party is over. No more hair. No more fake nails. No more you all being assholes. All that's gone. Because think about it. If they were going to release your food stamps in February, why did they release those uh, food stamps for February, January 19th, I'm not mistaken, 2019, but yet, turn around, the government shutdown is over at this moment, and it will be open on February. And may close February 15. Y'all don't realize what that's about? It hasn't crossed your mind. Hmm, why'd they do that? They still ain't mentioned anything about um munch food stamps. Now word on the street, I can heard that that ain't, ain't going down no more. Okay? The EBT card, no more of that. Food boxes. Delivered by UPS and FedEx. Okay? So you you're still gonna lose. Okay. So all oh, this little he got, 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 got. See, I told you, you didn't know what you were talking about. So that's the thing, you're always running that damn mouth. Okay? But see, all those days of uh, uh, viewers, y'all remember when we used to go on field trips as a kid? Bring your little lunch and everything. You go to the museum, you see that dinosaur? This is just bones. Why? Because it was something that lived and dominated and scared the shit out of people. They were so damn big for a time. But that time is no more and they're gone. So we go look at the bones of what once was, but it's no more. And that go to all the welfare bitches. Same thing. Parallel. It go out to all the food stamp bitches. Yeah. And the Section 8 bitches. The party is over. You either got to get off your lazy fat ass and get you a job, a 
go back to school or start your own business. Because now you consider you've been on it too long. But you signed that you was going to be on it for as least as possible. And you didn't. So now we sh- you know, bye-bye. Meow, 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 meow. Meow. And y'all want to get mad at us and blame us on the white men. No, the black men must be uh, jealous of the black woman. No, we're just reporting it to remind you that the party is over. And we're very, very happy. One of our songs is, if you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. And you're happy and you know it, and your face will truly show it. If you're happy that black females won't be getting food stamps anymore, clap your hands. And welfare. And section eight. Because y'all fucked it all up. Why? Because y'all got that nigga mentality. Okay? And now it's time for you all to be removed off it. It really doesn't matter if you don't want to get off it or not. Because everything is electronic. See, the new way is digital money, Bitcoin, uh, and many other ones. You know, so you can't stop it. They just don't deposit electronically in your account. The party is over with. Now, you know, it's, it's, it's no reason to, you know, point the fingers at us that we're uh, saying things that, as you say, that. Hateful. It's not hateful, it's truthful. Because you are never say that I'm lying. Because I know I'm not lying. I'm dropping the straight facts. The party is over. You are always boasting y'all strong, black, and independent. Okay, well, they're going to take it away from y'all. And we we as black men want y'all to prove that in deeds, that you all are strong, black, and independent. And not these welfare bitches, these food stamp bitches, these Section 8 bitches. Okay, that's fucking up everything for those who really worked for it, who really needs it, such as retirees and the disabled. But y'all don't give a fuck about that. See, and I'm glad that Shanae and Maisha and Laquisha, the ones that wear them hair weaves way all the way down to their ankles and they, you know, seven feet tall and shit. Mm-hmm. Fake ass nails. Mm-hmm. Eyelashes way out here looking like a fucking uh, Moby Dick's wife and shit. <laughs> You know, talking to y'all bitches. And if y'all don't like it, eat a motherfucking dick. 